but it's a big pond that you dump. That's a dam. It's yeah, the whole, all the way pipe, around. Pipe it out, and they, they, uh, these dams are built. North number one and number two are built with uh, a clay berm. Okay. Clay berm over here, okay. and they filled it with the tailings, basically. Yeah. The cyclone sands. Then they uh, clay berm, clay berm, and they just kept building them up. And they're about, in places, they're about 60 feet high. Uh, mm. And it's kind of interesting because if you stand on top of the dam, down off to one side, 10 feet down approximately is the tailings. And off the other side, you're to the top of the trees. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> Don't we so, get to go there? Oh yeah, yeah I'll show you that. <laughs> and, 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 that, and it's really neat because you're looking at this difference in elevation, and these north number two especially was is only about half of what they designed it to be for height. They, at one time, they were oh. going to go up, you know, considerably higher. So it's, it's pretty neat. Is the dam, that, the point of the dam to keep any drainage of all the stuff from getting out? Why, yep. why dam? You don't, not just yeah, piling it up. Yeah, well, so you got clay that, that amount, if you get up there, you can actually see Lake Superior is only a couple miles. Yeah. And if that dam wasn't there, that would be straight out to the lake. And that would be a lot of bad uh, yeah, stuff. That would be that's bad news. So you're <laughs> keeping the stuff contained. Yeah. And presumably the water level doesn't rise high enough to overflow. Yeah, we have area. we have overflow or all fault uh, pipes that are just placed there, and when it gets up high, it runs out and it goes to the system, you know, the system to get filtered out naturally. And uh, we monitor that water that comes out there also. That's so basically, there's bad stuff here that you want to keep contained. Um, not really bad stuff. Just we don't want to get uh, copper levels coming out that are at the toxic. Sicily level, yeah, and we're we are well below that. Always on our sample, yeah. we have never exceeded. But I mean, if you just let it go, it wouldn't be good. No, no, it would be an ecological disaster <laughs> yeah. of a major scale. Yeah, yeah. yeah it would be. It and would be bad. <laughs> so this is going to have to be contained forever, basically. Yeah. Wow. And Not the drainage the here is right, right. That. 20 years I was telling her, you know, when I took this job over five years ago, uh, my boss told me that, you know, I'm looking at this job for the next 15, 20 years before anything changes. Anything so. Is there a clay bed under it too? Or is it going down? Yeah, I think I think they built a dam and this, this area here is pretty much clay uh, anyway, so they don't have to a base on the oh. dam, and uh, yeah, so it's, it's, so it's, it's not a clay ball. down into the water table? No. no. Well, it's not, the, the dam isn't lined. You didn't go no, ahead and no. put a line of yeah. and There's a lot of glacial material here, which is pretty porous stuff, so um, I'm surprised there isn't some. We have, throughout the property, we have 35 or 30 wells, uh -huh. monitoring wells. As far as I'm aware, we 